This man's eyes are being tested for errors in his long distance vision. As he gets older, however, he will probably develop presbyopia, the gradual age-related loss of the ability to see clearly at short distances. It used to mean two pairs of glasses, one for reading and one for long distance. The problem was solved with bifocals, but the solution wasn't perfect. In a bifocal lens you have a sudden transition, so people have to jump from distance vision to near vision, and that causes a sudden change in magnification, uh, it causes uh, a jump in their direction of vision. In the late 1970s, a new kind of multifocal lens was developed, and the Australian-based company Solar International came up with their progressive multifocal lens which provided a gradual transition between the correction for both distance and near vision. It's all to do with the shape or curvature of the lens. Near vision needs a steeper curve than distance vision. And this is where the mathematical expertise of Dr Tony Miller from the Australian Science Agency, CSIRO, came in to further develop the concept. Basically what we've done is we've designed surfaces which have particular changes of curvature and uh, what I've been able to do is come up with some efficient uh, mathematical ways in which to do that. More than a hundred million people around the world now wear Solar's progressive multifocal lenses and CSIRO's Dr Tony Miller is continuing to develop software tools to allow Solar to develop better progressive glasses, reducing the time necessary to perfect and design new types of lens products.